let's get it to two sentence order you need to laugh at it first let's see the actual top of all time what's supposed to be the scariest thing that this subject you can think of in two sentences all my life my parents had told me not to open the basement door but i got curious and disobeyed them what is that glowing ball in the sky and why does it hurt my head oh it's a, and it's a pretty good twist but it's it's not exactly scary is it when the kidnapper made me guess where he kept my daughter i went for the basement and he said correct allowing me to see her but when i found a severed head in there i learned that every other choice would have been correct as well yeah yeah that's just that just makes me uneasy and not horrifying I've been working on stories to compete with the best from this son, but I'm finding it near impossible. I'm beginning to think some of you are just making yours up. What is this r slash jokes that I've said? She said last time we're stuck in a time loop, which really pisses me off then, because that's what... <laughs> These are not scary at all. Like, at least the first two are kind of, like... creepy situations but the, uh, she said last time we are stuck in a time loop which really pisses me off because that's what she said last time etc etc like that, that didn't scare to anyone I framed the first letter I got as a police officer from a woman thanking me after I supported her through her daughter's suicide I passed her in my hallway every day for nearly 8 years before realizing the handwriting was the same as on the girl's suicide hmm Hmm. Yeah, at least that's a pretty good twist. No, these aren't scary. And I think you should really understand the entire point of the subreddit. It's like you cannot really be scary in two sentences. At most, you can think of a pretty good twist. Now be careful, that line of rock salt is the only thing keeping them out. It's always them or that thing. or something with this <laughs> the man said welcome welcome in my group into his wreckage see salt the clap right see salt keeps us out <laughs> that, again scary man <laughs> that's kind of just a good twist again Not, nothing here is going to be scary they at least the first two are uneasy my husband had been very upset with me since my failed so as I left him He's crying non-stop and he won't acknowledge me. I'm beginning to think that there are ghosts. What the fuck? These will not be scary. As I slid, as I slid her throat, I looked in her unblinking eyes and realized too late that she wanted to live. I knew it to be true because mirrors don't lie. But that's just depressing. What the fuck? Please take me inside. I screamed, grabbing at the two men who took my child. Sorry, my children only, they said, as I continued loading up the last life for all the shit. But you're... And you're just selfish, selfish as fuck. Like you know them children. <laughs> Why? That shit. Again. So it turns out you can feel everything that happens to your body after death. I suppose I should be glad that my husband still finds me. Uh, yeah, still finds me attractive after all these years. Yeah, yeah, I do not like that. Yeah, Tinder is completely useless, and I don't have a single match. If I don't find another way to start a campfire tonight, I'll freeze to death. <laughs> Then come on. <laughs> The principal of my son's school called me at work today to tell my son pushed another kid by on the school bikes first. I initially thought this was hardly, this hardly warranted a phone call until I remembered that my son's excursion was still a grand canyon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's, again, not scary, but it's a pretty good twist. These are just twists or just funny. In the tsunami that most people were evacuated, feeling the trickle of water rise to my chin, I let go of the prison bars and bitter resentment. Mm. Mm. Fair enough. Again, 
then pretty yeah, nice actually it's just a pretty good two sentence story for my last wish I wish my dad to be at high with me I stood atop his grave and smiled imagining him screaming and clawing at his coffin bed as he did the two previous times I wished him back what the fuck <laughs> this is this is just a bit further but still not going to scare anyone is it and so it's 2020 the time down they say very early in from the looks of it he uh, muttered under his breath hmm? what? shit battery at 1% hello there was one last time before my suit ran out of color it's, it's not bad but again you can't get to eat the skin from two sentences it's been almost a decade since I last, last saw my mother and she still reminds me every day that if I misbehave she'll take away my hearing too fuck you that is a fucked story they say you die once and you stop breathing and the second time when someone says you're near for the last time sitting alone in my dilapidated apartment for years now I realize it's not always in that all yeah and this feels a bit too weird fucking like, you know, hell it's a bit depressing Yesterday I visited my boyfriend who was serving a life sentence in prison. And the worst and asked, so shaking and pissing himself with fear and knew he finally regretted beating me today. Okay, after reading like 10 of these, it does kind of get a bit repetitive. My grandmother died giving birth to my mother who died giving birth to me. As I feel my consciousness slip away, I pray that my baby is a boy. They say we have a primal sense that we can just feel when someone is watching us. In a few weeks and you it's clear that you do not have that sense <laughs> that's again a pretty good twist not scary is it i feel paralyzed patiently waiting for the curse to be lifted by true love's case and the brain scan he tore away my dress with last night then i felt i was meant to be scared yeah. yeah that just feels like one of the people that find those would um these are fairy tales but in real life like youtube skits or whatever bullets flew, flew through the mall ripping close to set in the chaos nobody no one noticed the mannequins right? hmm. very good concept but i'd be fucking confused here i am trying my best to swim while slowly leading to life as i see the birds sailing away what do they even need my fins for that's again a bit sad Then he made me sit in a chair while he tied his leg from the tooth to the door. Before he slammed the door, he said, tell me where my mom you went so we can stop doing this. What the fuck? Uh, that doesn't make a lot of sense, but it's still just a bit weird. Let's go to some of the things I've read. This is shit.